Hey everyone, I'm Captain Forest Falcon. Welcome back to Let's Play Summon Knight Swordcraft Story Blind. So, let's set sail. How, how do? How do I set sail? I'm ready to go. What do? What do? Game! Maybe I actually need to go ask his permission. Maybe that's a good idea. Maybe just not boat jack. <laughs> hey Braun, I'm taking your boat. Hey, Kaleru, you're here for a ship, ain't ya? I heard from Sakura earlier. Yeah, give me your boat. <laughs> uh, you can have my ship, but be careful. I promise not to hit anything with it. Too hard. Yeah, I'm not talking about the ship. I'm talking about you. I don't care. That ship's a piece of garbage anyway. It lost its mid condition after you sailed in it. All right. And here's a new technique for ya. Oh, yay! Take good care of Claru, Zantek. Star! Whoa, not so fast. Go forge the last weapon I taught you before moving on to the next. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Braun. <laughs> We're just gonna set sail. Does our mom say anything to us if we t just go and tell her? Yo, mom, we're heading to a volcano. Uh, nope. Nope. Nothing to say about that, huh? <laughs> okay, thanks, mom. <laughs> Alright, so with that, I will meet you on the ship. Mysterious person. Just wait. Who? Who could it be? Oh, are you the... Be careful. Sometimes one can try to exceed his capabilities and get infected with darkness. Jade must be captured in the darkness. Jade. Jade. Craft Lord of Jade Eurexa must be captured in the darkness. Being a hero doesn't mean he's a hero to everyone. I know another who is honored by no one because he turned to the darkness for someone he believes in. Uh, come back alive. What the heck admission are we going on? Hero honored by no one. Is that Shintetsu? A hero honored by no one. Because... Because Shintetsu is not really known by anyone, despite being this great... Right? We don't know much about him. It seems like not many people know. Here you are. Your father, Master Shintetsu, took good care of my sister. Zantek, you too. Star! I can't thank you guys enough. Thank you. Um, excuse me. Uh... I'll, I'll let my mom know about this. Please do so. By the, by the way, do you know of any heroes who are still alive? Huh? Shintetsu died and then became a hero. Heroes must stay alive so they can see the smiles of the people whose lives they save. One person who was once called a hero is still alive and talks about what it was like to be a hero. Huh. There's a town called Seijin, far south of here. I've heard that they have a hero. Do you know anything about it? I've, I've heard the hero's a man. I've heard the hero's a woman. I don't know anything. What are you talking about? Urgh. I've heard absolutely nothing. So I could say I don't know anything. The... Uh... I don't know anything, so I'm going to assume their gender. And please, game, let's see if you can prove me wrong once again. Oh, I've heard about that. The hero's totally a woman, right? I've heard she is spirited. Heard she is shy. Weird. I've heard a rumor that she's so spirited that everyone instantly recognizes her as a hero. So I heard. I've always wanted to meet that hero. Heroes might not always be everybody's darlings. I want to know if heroes are able to remain true to themselves, even when there is great danger to themselves and those they care about. After Shintetsu's death, that hero is the only one I can ask. I'm sorry, I talk too much. Let's sail out now. Follow my ship. Okay, I guess I won't go and 
talk to mom about how I'm going. I mean, I kind of did, but the game doesn't know that. <laughs> Ooh, I like this little groovy music. Dunno. Let's see. Oh, okay. I was just going to check the Steam Cloud, but then the game's just like, Nope, don't go and kill yourself by breathing in toxic fumes, you idiot. Thanks for waiting for me, Master Yurexa. Hey, I've been thinking. I've decided that I'll just go by myself. I'm sorry, Claru. I know we did, like, this weeks and weeks long boat trip out here, and, you know, we don't have any food. You kind of left that in my department, and I'm, I'm just gonna leave you here. Goodbye. Uh, what? He just kicked me in the crotch. Like, what the heck? What? What is this? Like, we go boating out here, we come down here, and it's like, cool, thanks for coming out. Here's your reward. Ugh! Straight to the nads. I agree, Zantic. Star. <laughs> you. Hey, you. Okay, welcome to the game of genders. Uh, girl? Guy? I'm gonna assume everyone's a girl until you prove me wrong, game. Hey, wake up! Star. Uh, what? Ugh, out. Hey, hey, get up! If you sleep here, you'll catch a cold. Hmm? What's your name? Who's this? She just asked for my name! Yes, I called it! Finally! <laughs> I could have gone and said guy, but I'm just like, No, I'm not going to let this get me. Is there any wonder why I thought Eurexo was, was a girl first time I saw? I swear, Eurexa looks more like a girl than this girl looks like a girl. Ugh! She just asked for me. Uh, my name is Claro, this is Zantek. Nice meeting you! What an odd looking summon beast! Star! And was I wasn't sleeping here earlier. <laughs> you fainted, didn't you? I could tell just by looking. Ugh. Well, that's what I thought happened. So, that's... Uh... That's hard for <laughs> What? What is that? Is that like a saying or something? That's like hard for it. <laughs> hard for it. That means no problem. Now I'd better get going. Uh, excuse me. What's up? Oh yeah, you'd like to know over the name of the lady who saved you, huh? I'm Natsumi. You might want to remember that for later. Okay then, I've got things to take care of now. Don't try to follow me, okay? Like any love affair or fight, it's not in your best interest to rush after the other person. Who who was that? What is going on? Oh, where is Master Rexa? He kicked me in the dick after I followed him in my ship. I need to know why he knocked me out. Although, wasn't Beautiful Woman telling us that he's gonna fall into darkness or something? Be a hero? Let me breathe the fubes game. Let me just stand inside of this. <laughs> I guess not. Anyway, uh, Natsumi, you said not to follow you. There is literally only one path I can take. Unless, can, can I just leave? Can I just say, well, guess there's nothing for it. I'm going back. Game's not letting me. Game's not going to let me just bail. <laughs> oh, but I want to. I want to just bail. There's got to be a point where we get free reign with our uh, ship and we can start going back to areas that we've been to because so far we've kind of been required to take certain paths. Oh boy. Where am I? What's with the what's with the warp paths? What are you? <laughs> Not who are you? What are you? Uh are you Oak? Oh, Claru! James, I thought it was you. How are you doing, buddy? What are you doing here, man? Uh, Master Lu... Master Lubert asked me to come here and look for something. Oops, I just told you our secret. What? I wasn't really listening. Uh, and Chase, you're such an awesome guy. By the way, did I tell you how good your blade has been? Man, that thing has carried me hard through this tournament. I don't think I've actually won a tournament match without using it. 
except the one against you. Isn't that right, Zatek? Chave's Plate is just that good. Uh, this Inquisition is over. Oh man, we gotta fight Chaves again. No, I don't have Chaves Blade. I can't beat Chaves with Chaves Blade. Uh. Oh, can I? Uh, Chaves. Hey, Chaves. Chaves, I'm gonna break your weapon again. Wait. This is like the same fight. Like, it's like the exact same fight, my gosh. Except we have a better weapon. Chaves, uh, we're going to beat him the exact same way, too. Because cause he just keeps guarding. Keep guarding, Chaves. Yeah, it worked so well for you last time. Ow, ow. Chaves, keep your guard up, man. Just keep it up for me. <laughs> Victory! We broke Chaves' weapon again. For the second time. Man, that is weird. Because it's like... we It's like the exact same fight, except he has a ton more health. <laughs> but man, Chaves, I'm so happy to see you again. It's been a lot of fun, and I got to break your weapon again. Man, if only I'd been able to do it with Chaves' blade, though. That would have been so much more fitting. Ah, uh, uh, dang it! My mission doesn't include fighting you guys. Goodbye! Yeah, Chaves. What was that about, Star? Okay. So, interestingly, it looks like Loop, he was working with Waluigi. Man, so many of the guys that have great voices are looking like... Also, look at this statue. <laughs> it, it, it looks so... These statues look great. <laughs> it just looks like he's got like this... Mm, this uh, kind of face. like Just like this smug grin. On all of these. Just like, yeah, I'm a demon, what of it? <laughs> anyway, uh, so we fought Chaves. Anyway, that's cool. I wonder if we would have also gotten Chaves Blade if we'd done that fight. Uh, this seems like a dungeon. So, oh, we got a Red Lantern. Oh, boy. We're fighting some dragon puppies. Ow. Ow. They don't seem that hard. <laughs> hey, no. Uh, let me just uppercut you a bit. Man, look at this. Woo! Just like send him up to the moon, why don't you? Fire starter. Cool. So I'm not going to go in that one yet because I want to check the... There was another one up here. Also, why? why is there a bridge to nowhere? Game, you don't just put a bridge like that and have it lead to nowhere. Like, man, if this was a Mario game, I would be jumping around there so hard searching for a hidden block. What is this? Uh. Okay, guess that's nothing. Guess we're going in. Dungeon, here we come. Actually, wouldn't it be... What if there's, like, another path that you can take around here that just skips this dungeon like the last, uh, the last one? Ooh, is that something I can break? That looks like something breakable. Oh, it's an Onibi! <laughs> uh. Man, these guys take such a long wind-up, I can just go to town on them. Like, holy cow! Like, they have such poor reach, and they take so long to charge up their attack. They're, like, not a threat at all. So I can break this, right? Come on, this looks so breakable. Okay, what do we got? Give me the goods. There's the path down. Do 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 do. Excuse me, I'm gonna uppercut you because as long as your buddy doesn't bug me when I do this, it'll be fine. Come on. Boop. There we go. And now just finish him off. Man, this axe does work in these dungeons. Although maybe I should switch, try those new fists that I got. Yeah, where are the gauntlets? Uh, let me just change these over to the better gauntlets, which are the Sting Claws. And also let's switch up Gladius. Uh, 
Let's switch up Gladius for our new best drill. Yeah, that does some pretty good damage. Yeah, that's second only to our axe. But the gauntlets are probably going to be even better than that just because of the fact that we can combo with them. Huh, that, that's so weird how there's just like this thing that looks like a rock you can break. Ow. Ow, stop that. Okay, what do we want to do? No, that doesn't seem right. I want to charge this. Yikes. Okay, you know what? Let's just do the axe, because this seems to be working out all right. Actually, no, let's try the gauntlets. Hey, get in there. The only annoying thing with these guys, really, is when they're in pairs. So it's like, if I get them separate, they're not much of a problem. Oh yeah, and I can just start uh, my fist combo normally, and then move into the uppercut. I've got to remember it. That's why i got to keep on practicing with the gauntlets. Because it's like, when you, when you combo properly with them, you can, like, tear through enemies without them ever getting a hit on, in on you. Okay, now these guys, though, are just so slow... The only problem is, again, if they uh, team up with each other. Like, see? Like, he is just so slow that he can't do anything. Like, they can't even, like, get the bite in on me if I keep my distance right. Doop, doop. Get that experience in. Okay. Uh, okay, I'll meet you on the next floor. I'm assuming there's going to be a fight between now and then. Okay. Who are you? Wait, are you the... Are you the Natsumi? What's that, Star? Psst, be quiet. Er, I didn't ex... It's that... Er, I... D no, let me think. Who could that be? Where? I didn't expect the volcano to be this active. Yes, I called it. Even you, Master Luber, couldn't have foreseen this. Oh, it's Master Eurexa and Lubert. I wonder if Master Lubert is also here to do research on the volcano. <sighs> we must fi first bring Shintetsu's sword outside. Yeah, that's right. We came here for this without Rondo or his craft Lord Flunkies finding out about this. We've waited long enough for the excitement to die down. It's important for us to collect the swords and give them to the Deglands. Wait a second, don't you think it's too early to give it to the Diglea just yet? Eurexa, you're a young, young boy. I don't know what you're plotting, but you will fail if you let too much show in your body language. But, Master Lubert... Let me take care of this, don't worry. Your wish shall come true if it all goes according to my plan. We'll hand the Digleans the sword now. And they will remember us for our fine work. They'll provide us with good jobs there. Eurexa, we shall begin now. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Huh. Damn it, Lubert. He's just a puppet of Diglea. Uh, no one can stop us now, sister. Uh. Now, like I was just saying, beautiful woman could be like Sinari's sister, but what if that, what if, what if Eurexa is like a uh, beautiful woman's brother? Ugh. What if they are both related? They couldn't be, there's no way that, Sinari doesn't also have, her brother isn't also like Eurexa, is it? Or something? Like we're not talking about one big family here. Like, is there another sister that I'm not thinking of? Ugh. Dang it. So what they're talking about must be my dad's. Star! Ah, oh, you look so serious. Is there any reason for that? Mm. Let me guess. You're the good one, and they're the bad ones. Is that fair enough? Huh? Is, is that how you see this? I haven't told you anything about myself yet. Ah, oh, don't sweat the small stuff. 
The important thing is to gather so much information that you'll be able to tell what's good and bad. What's collected, you just have to believe in yourself and your ability to know the difference. Uh, let me see. They're trying to hand that hidden sword over to the Deglaeans, aren't they? Perhaps. That sword belongs to your father and means a great deal to you. Uh, yes. It must have some sort of power or else the others wouldn't have been so careful with it. But you think the Deglaea can't be planning on using the sword for good things. And that's it. You're the good guy and they're the bad guys, right? Yeah, sure. I've got some things to do, but I'll help you out. We need to stop them, but let's catch up with them first. Now, let's hurry up. Okay, you're you're just going to go on ahead, is that right? Okay, you're going to go on ahead. I'm not going to have like a party system or anything. Can I craft down here? No. Man, it's I can't sleep though. I can I can use the bed. Always bugs me how there's like these ones that are like down here in a dungeon and it's like, "Oh cool, can I craft down here with them?" Nope. No doing that. You have to leave if you want to go craft some new weapons. Oh boy, a warp maze. Okay, good. It shows us where we go though. I thought it was just going to like instantly transmit us. I I don't like you. I don't like you. Oh gosh, I can't up But I can't uppercut you. I can just uppercut you to death. <laughs> Man, that bastard looked really creepy, though. Also, why did I get, like, no bonus experience for that? Like, I barely took any damage from that. Oh, boy. I, I don't like the fact that there's two things. Uh, don't... Please don't knock him back towards the big baddie. Ow. Please don't. Okay. Hey, stop it. Stop burning me from afar. Okay. Let's see. What can we use? Do, 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 do. Oh, man. So, if he's charging up like that, I can't actually stun him. Come on. Get through. Get through everything. Sheesh. Okay. I, like, an ordinary punch worked, I think. Just get a little bit of bonus. I still don't really understand what it is determining uh, bonus. Is it time-based, or what is it? Hmm. Okay, we just got the thing there. Anything else down here? <laughs> like, yeah, this works really well. Like, the drill works really well if you can get them in the corner and then just do that to them. Like, that's what you need to do. Like, you need to be able to get in tight and then, like, just go to town. Uh, let's give a bit more attack. Since we're using some low uh, attack weapons that combo a lot, uh, the extra attack will be more beneficial, I think. Do do. Like, I haven't commented that much on the music uh, for the most part in this playthrough so much. Usually, I, I don't know, maybe it's just the way it sounds. I haven't paid too much attention to it, really, but... There's some good there's some good stuff here. Ugh. Stop it. Man, it's so much it's amazing how much harder it is to deal with them when there's two. Hey. Hey, stop that. Okay. Like once that once I'm down to like two, then it's like fine. Cause then I can just like uppercut them and finish them. So maybe I should use like big stuff to like get in and out like early on let me just heal up uh magic how are we doing for magic anyway got a lot of healing now uh i think we are full also we got the nap so we have the bed there i just went back i just went backwards didn't i oh boy gotta love those warp mazes okay one more thing. Can I check this at all? Is this the thing? Nope. Okay, what do we have? Okay, that's the way down. So just some, just break some barrels and then we'll head down. Doodle loop. Oh, no, no battle? Okay, cool. I'm fine with that. Can't reach that one, so... 
All that matters really is... Oh, there are so many here. Ugh. Okay, we came in through that one, so we go through here. Okay, this might not be so bad if they're going to be that close together. Uh, but, okay, so we're going in the near one first. I'm only running because I don't want to get lost. Okay, I want to get the treasure. Okay, so I immediately just found the way out. So I now that I know, I can go back and I can find what I want. So, let's see. Do, do, do. Oh, yikes. Not liking this. Like I said, the thing I really hate. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Oh, the thing I really hate is when they group up when they've got no HP. Like, that's just a thing that always happens. Like, seriously. Like, look, this guy is not going to even be a problem now. Not going to be a problem because you don't have your buddies just covering for you all the freaking time. Ugh, that was an ugly battle. Ugh, that was really ugly. Anyway. Okay, so we want to go through here. Let's find the dead end here. Good. Get the materials. Get, yeah, nice. Always good to get some things that we can craft with. Okay, so now we can go back. Okay. Ugh. Some of these battles are a bit tricky, but we're going to get the chest, and that's what... Was that another chest up there? Ooh, I do not like these. Well, these guys actually aren't, like, any different from their predecessor type. Like, they're really just, like, the same. Like, there's nothing to... Oh. But this guy, he's not a problem unless you get hit by anything he does. <laughs> yeah, he's not a problem until you get hit by him. Oh, come on, really? He survived with, like, four freaking HP. Well, we're at least getting some potions, so maybe I want to use those instead to heal. Actually, I bought tomato juice for a reason. We might as well use it. There's no reason not to. It saves me from having to use my heal. Ugh. Okay. Okay, there was nothing there. Right? Oh, what is this monstrosity? I am not going to go into this without healing. Holy. Uh, this makes me want to bring out my axe. Oh, he is... Uh, let me... I want to jump over you. This is why you want to have something with good agility. Oh, he, he can hit like a tank. Ugh. What is the strategy on this? This seems to be working pretty effectively. Because it is actually stunning him. Oh, except not cutting him off from doing that. Oh. Uh, give me, give me gauntlets. What do I do against a guy like this? This is like something that I would want a spear for, actually. Okay, get in, get out. Like, maybe just running in with the axe is really like the best thing to do against something like that, because he is too big to get stunned. It's also a bit disappointing not to have any sort of... Uh, you know, like, healing thing? <gasps> oh! Okay. Natsumi, Master Lubert, and Master Eurexa. Oh, boy. Clairu? I thought you had already finished off the whelp. Uh... Cut it out! Are we getting on your nerves, Miss Hero Sage Ant? Now I'm getting it more like Waluigi. <laughs> What, is she the hero of Sagent that Eurex Eurexa mentioned? 
Oh, let me guess. I actually kind of was wondering about this, like just during the fact that they described the hero and I could choose gender, that maybe this would be the person that's the gender because they could be, they literally could be male or female. That was a deliberate choice. They could be, I'm actually curious, so they could be whatever character you make them to be? So you could like choose their personality. Are they spirited or are they shy? Are they male or are they female? That that would actually that's actually a really cool detail if that's what happened there. Thanks for introducing me. You know quite a lot of things like who I am. Hehe, <laughs> I'm no average civilian. In politics, if you haven't heard the tale of the nobles and pious heroine, everyone will consider you some kind of idiot. I see. Well then, it's good idea for you to return the sword to this child. Just do it. What a fool. How can you consider yourself a hero without having heard the other side's reasoning? Don't call yourself a hero. You make me sick. What's wrong with fighting for the smiles of my precious friends? For your friends and loved ones, is that your only goal? I have no goals. What is important to me? How can I make everyone happy? That's all I care about. Very well. Now I can't give this up just for my own goals. What are you getting confused about? The winner rewrites history. That's the only goal. The young man there knows how to hold a conversation, but this old man doesn't at all. I have my own business to do, so I'll have to cut this short and push my way through. Oh... Spirits of Metropa, heed my call! Come and serve your summoner! Hippos! <laughs> wow, that's uh, that's quite the guardian beast you have there. Wow, so this is the power of a hero. Good, let's leave the bad guys here, and you guys can go ahead and find that sword. I need to find a summoner who I've been hunting down, so I'll go off on my own from here. Let's be back when we're both done and get out of this oven. See you later! Uh, okay, you, you're just gonna leave this giant hippo here? Let's go, Zantec. And, uh, you want to have some kind of super move as well, Zantec? Uh, hippo thing? Can I talk to you? No? Oh, I wanted to go that way. Okay, fine, I'll fight the fire mage. Uppercut, uppercut, uppercut. Ugh. Like, just get in and get out. <laughs> so, like, when they're charging the moose, you can't do it then. But afterwards, yeah, sure. Oh, boy, so many fights. Uh, uh. Oh, my gosh. I could literally just combo forever. I never have to let him die. I could do this forever. <laughs> oh, my gosh, this is the best. Yes. Yes. Yes, I will do an Ultra Omega Combo! <laughs> I feel like I deserve a bigger bonus for that. All the bonus damage I was doing. <laughs> like, I was wondering if I could do that, and I finally managed to do that. Okay, we got a level up. And I think I will put a bit into defense right now, because I feel like I'm getting beat up a lot by these guys. Now, I've been recording for a long time. I may have to break things up into two episodes, so I think we're going to leave off here. Uh, so next time. Next time on Summon Knight Swordcraft Story Blind. We're going to explore the rest of this place. We're probably going to fight a boss by the end of it. And it's going to be it's gonna be a good time, I'm sure. So be sorry like the Basin Falcons you are, and have a wonderful day. Peace out.